Hello everyone and welcome back for another episode of Diablo 4. Uh, we're most of the way through level 55, I'd say two thirds of the way through. Uh, and uh, today we're going to be focusing on the Helltide. It should be starting in about eight minutes. So before that happens, uh, we've got a couple of things that we could do in, in Hauazar. Um, most notably, I think we're going to head over here to Eremon's Pyre see if we can do something in that region now the reason i want to follow uh, focus on the helltide is we need to kill helltide commanders if we're going to have any chance of um completing the season journey this year so, this year uh i mean before it finishes that's what i mean to say uh let's let's go for the acrobatics elixir this time so we've got uh, we've got plenty of side quests that we can pick up as well. Um, it's not a bad idea to try escorting this lady as well, but we'll uh, we'll do Ermin's pie first, and then as soon as the hell tide rises, we'll go off and not while I'm in town. Work around that. Look for more. Talk to gift mysteries gather a whole ton of cinders and and inevitably we're going to end up getting a bunch of fiend roses as well this uh this season's kind of an experiment for me oh treasure goblin i'm not ready yet It's kind of an experiment for me. Let's try and get these guys killed. Right. Um, because I don't know how much um, time, like physical time, um, it's going to take to do a season journey. Some of the options on there, like get to level 100, you can make the leveling still be burning more efficient but it's still going to be pretty time intensive killing uber lilith that's something that would need us to be level 100 wait i was here all those years ago just a child i can still smell the cooked flesh Please, a word. Is that word barbecue? The ledger that shows the... I hoped... Uh, we need to find ledger pages somewhere in this area. <clears throat> it's possible that they're going to be... Another treasure goblin. Oh, cool. Got damage resistance because of the uh, the nearby skeleton. But not for long. That is that is really good. That's two two bits right from the start. This chest is not letting me open it. Hmm. Okay, don't see anything over there. Let's, um... We're definitely not going to go into that dungeon. But we are going to explore all the... All the potential nearby bits. Looking for, for books... Nothing immediately obvious. That's a bit of a shame. Let's uh, carry on over this way. This is mostly killing time until the Helltide appears, of course. Ah, I think... They hide yeah, right. So there was... Witches live among them. There was something that I they saw up here. At welcoming us. And all the while they work toward dark. There it is. The screams have summoned the witch. This Eriman claims he wants to protect these people. 
but his sins damned them all. His pyre will be the first if we are to save this wicked place. Now we know what we're Only doing. Fire can purge this grand corruption, cauterizing the wound. The whole town will be boiled in the pits if the vile witches will not show themselves. Uh, that's the way out, so we don't want to go that way. Burn these guys down. There's the final book. You cannot throw a stone without hitting an accomplice of the witches of Hawazar. None will renounce this hateful faith, even with the clarity of pain. Okay, so uh, back, back we go to the town. And we'll hand these ledger pages into the elder. You see now many. Cool. Side quest complete, and we got a couple of uh, uniques out of it. Taking direct damage and less damage from crowd control. They're just going to get salvaged up. They're not particularly spectacular. Let's um, hurry on up. We might have enough time to do this escort mission. I cannot do that here. Before the hell tide rises. Now this road does feel like it's a long way, but hopefully we'll be able to do it on horseback. Hi, what are you doing here? I am on my way to Reggie. I want to. All right. All right. Yeah, he needs to find herbs. I need time to prepare that. Well, luckily, <clears throat> I was coming down here for a tonic, but I'm desperate. We've tried everything else, everything. Luckily, they're relatively easy to get. Come on, keep up, my friend. It's just. Are you all done with that one? Let's get you down to the next one. <clears throat> I can't not do this. Not when I know that it will help. I can't sit here and watch my baby die. Just three men anxious in the eye of right. the church. Back to the town we go. Not while I'm in town. Well done. Thank you. They think. Cool, that is two side quests done in just a matter of minutes. And we've got plenty of herbs for that. There is the hell tide. It has risen. So we're gonna head straight across. Um and we might be able to do other side quests while we're in the area, but our focus is going to be on killing things and getting cinders and looking for those uh, gifts and mysteries. Uh, before we go out, we could do a little bit of salvaging. I cannot do that here. Or selling, actually. Selling would be better. Salvaging for the legendaries. You can still use this. I cannot do But we need to be selling stuff because we are out of money. 
We'll sell to the jeweler as we go past. All things have value. Okay, People that gives us a little bit of funds. So the hell tire begins. Nine cinders right off the back. I need time. Ooh, this is a lot of scorpions. Moving forwards. Being able to put out our um, firewalls so frequently because of that reduced mana cost is is really quite amazing. I love it so much. We're also going to want to keep our eyes peeled for any um, any events so we can try summoning the Helltai Commander. Apparently the uh, um, the event is bugged at the moment. Which is why when we killed the Commander it didn't, um, uh, didn't pick it up. It's not always bugged apparently. Um, so we're just going to need to keep trying and trying and trying if we see those events. Hey, there's a paragon point for us. We don't need to put it in right now, so we'll keep our focus on this uh, on this hell tide. Only up to thirty six cinders at the moment. Right, there is a tortured gift. It is of jewelry. Bigger groups. Bigger groups, more cinders. And the Helltide Prophets are where the fun is at. Let's do a little bit of exploding fun. There's an event. Let's uh, let's head down for that. Yeah. If we're lucky, it's going to be the portal summoning. Wretching mass. I'm not ready. Wow, that is uh. That's a lot of ick. So, drink a healing potion. Malignant pause. It's not the event that we wanted. I mean, the malignant stuff is is fine to be fighting. I lack the needed mana. But there is going to be the big ones that we need to watch out for. I lack the needed mana. Let's 
try and get good damage on this guy. Ah, oh, where'd you run away to? Out of mana once again. Okay. Paint complete. We got a few cinders and some bits and bobs out of it, so not a complete waste of time. Not very efficient for cinders though. That's another gift of jewellery. I'm not ready yet. We need more events. More events, more mobs to kill. Getting quite a lot of uh, lucky hits in there with the uh, with the extra firewalls appearing. No cinders for us. Well, one cinder. That's not not particularly great. We've still got uh, a lot of time left. Somewhere around 40 minutes for this episode, which, you know, we'll be able to get up to a decent number. There's a treasure goblin up there. Let's go get him. I'm not ready yet. Oh no, the assassin. This is the worst time. Damn it. Okay, let's uh let's back away somewhere safer. The assassin's behind us, so we don't wanna go too close to him. We could try and fight the assassin, but he's such a high level relative to us. That's a shame. Shame that the treasure goblin got away. Right, let's have a look at the hell tide. I think we'll uh, we'll try and head. You know what? We'll head head south. I wonder if the uh, things like the um, gifts of mysteries always end up in the same place. Um, random chance. Okay, Helltide Harbinger, we can we can fight you. Definitely should not be looking at the map while this is going on. few more cinders out of that but it was only a few so we're up to 108 at the moment Ooh, and we can work on grim favors at the same time well that's even more experience getting all of these. Torture gift of protection, interesting. Let's 
So in total, we've made it up to a thousand cinders. For this session, we're only on 120. There we go. We have a target. You know what? Let's, uh, let's not get frozen by him. Cool. That does a lot for our Grim Favor gathering. 127 cinders under our belt. And it looks like there's another event. Although that event appears to be liberation. So I don't know how much we want to lean towards it versus our side quests. We are getting a good amount of harvesting, though. Big batch. Let's get an inferno out. We need to kill flies in this area as well. But I think we are done with the southern expanse, so we should find where we're gonna drop. I'm out of mana. Drop these essence bits off. Okay, where is the southern expanse bit? There it is. So we'll ignore our side quest for the moment, just go and drop this off, and then we'll come back. Torture gift of weaponry. There's a fair few torture gifts around, just haven't seen the one of mysteries. I'm not ready yet. Just around this corner. Right, he's going to explode. There we go. We can return to the Tree of Nightmares. Tree of Whispers. We're basically doing stuff in the Nightmare area. Oh, yeah, look at that, Fiend Rose. Wayward Soul event. That's not an event that we care about. Torture gifts, jewelry. Ah, oh, wait, hang on. Are all the gifts marked? Protection, jewelry, protection. It might be that the ones in your area are marked. We'll grab this um, this little side uh, We want the uh, the side quests in the area because we've uh, we've been getting through some side quests so we've got some space for them. And we're gonna need to do them for our renown. Climb up. Maybe it's just the uh, the mysteries gifts aren't actually uh, marked on your map. I'm 
Okay, you're gone. I think we actually needed to be down below, so we'll head back down there. more cinders what's going on I need you need water well there's there's water just over here isn't there that's a glyph I didn't realize you could get glyphs outside of um, nightmare dungeons Intriguing. Guys, I'm just trying to get a drink of water for this chat. Cool. Nice little side quest. That did not take much effort. Let's, um... Let's grab this one down here as well while we're in the area. Yeah. Killing stuff on the way, of course. Now we could... Um, run back to the uh, the tree and then come back here and uh, and keep fighting but it will take us time to go back to the tree Fiend Rose. Yeah, all the side quest stuff is coming for us right now. We'll keep moving. We'll kill those guys on the way back. And we'll ignore the bloated corpses as much as we can. I'm not dead yet. I see that. <laughs> Oh! Goblin! Out of mana, once again. Got him! Great! That was worth it. Okay, let's uh, get this guy up out of the sand. There you go, freedom. So we need to take him back to town. We also need to get him a weapon. Oh, it's the shipment we've got to take back to town. This is worth us doing though, because it's it's good clusters of mobs. It's all extra cinders, and it's going to show us if there's. Uh, If there's any gifts over here. Now I may be of some use to you. I just have to Okay, we'll keep burning through all of these. We have plenty of time. Uh, I will drink us a new potion though. So close to being level 56 and getting another one of our Caesar's Blessings. Up to 229 cinders as well.
worst case scenario, if we don't find any gifts of mysteries, we can still go around for and open the regular out of regular gifts. No. Already I am plagued with visions of his You can thank our new friend later, Yaku. Damage resistance is coming from somewhere up there. Two hundred and thirty-eight cylinders. Doing uh, doing these missions during the hell tide is that? Hey, there's one of the mysteries. Perfect. So we just need another eleven. 11 cinders and we can come back and uh, I'm not ready yet. and do that and I think there's going to be enough in this area especially with that damn soul two more there's there's enough Hey, and level 56 as well. Right, let's go open the Gift of Mysteries. I'm not ready yet. Three sacred legendaries and a bunch of elixirs. Right, we need to clear some stuff from our inventory. Let's go sell a bunch of it, stock up our money, and then we'll come back and carry on. We've also got this shipment box we can hand in quickly while we're here. I wondered what happened. My burden is too great. Uh, for now, we will just drop that. Should have definitely sold stuff first. See anything you like? Okay, sell, sell, sell. Yes, yes. Sell, I'll sell. Do. Okay, everything else we keep. It's just failed crystals, that's fine. I don't think there's really any any point in us grabbing the topaz, but we will while we're here. Uh, we're pushing up towards this board, so strength or willpower, let's go. Willpower, then willpower. I don't think there was anything else that we wanted to do in town right now. But seeing as we've got our gift of mysteries, we can take the time to go over to the tree quickly. And then come back. Ooh, there is something that we need to do. We need to put our next blessing in. Which was back here. There we go. Claim that. And that is going into XP. It gets less and less as you're, you're putting it up. But that's, uh, that's to be expected. It is done. Uh, oh, geez. Don't like any of these. Let's go for a collection of amulets. Because we might get... A a spectacular amulet that's better than our current ones. Nope. More stuff that can be sold. Okay, back to collecting cinders. Oops. 
so where is the rest of his family? Because we've we've checked this cove pretty thoroughly. One tucked in up here that, time to prepare that I didn't see. Oh, yeah. Hello. No, that's just a weapon rack. Maybe down at the docks. Ah, uh, yes. But how? That's everyone. Let's meet them by the land. I will definitely take the extra cinders on the way through. He's a big chunky guy. Let's uh, get some healing on for that. I'm done with your explodiness. Now you give me renown and I start heading back across. Thank you. Oh, yes. We did get a cash though, so. My burden is too great. Oh my god, we are we are full on consumables. Alright, let's um Let's drink the man slaying one. We're probably going to want to salvage up some of our smaller glyphs. Uh, not glyphs, nightmare sigils. Back up to 28 cinders. We actually did an overpower there. Haven't seen an overpower in a very long time. Okay, we are gonna head up this way, but we're gonna head up via. I'm not ready yet. Via the hell tide itself. Or another whisper silenced. That's actually quite a lot of experience that we're we're getting looking at it. Some from the Helltide itself, some from the quests, um, and some from the whispers. Hey, there's someone running around as well looking for I assume mysteries. Moving 45. It's not many. I can burn you better than you can burn me. With the uh, with the gifts of mysteries, I don't know if we'll get back up to two hundred and 
250 cinders. But the real question is whether we're going to find another gift of mysteries to open up. Another paragon point to assign. A spotted mushroom. We can hand that in. A bit more renown. I've only got about 10 to 15 minutes left that we can work with before I need to finish up. That's possibly the uh, the only difficulty is these things don't always fit nicely. I need time to prepare them. That is a lot of poison damage that it's been putting out for us. Almost up to seventy five cinders. Protection, protection. That's going to be 75. Let's um, let's open it up. I think we're going to have another harbinger arriving nearby. Boo! Those were pretty pants. Okay, what are we? Doing. We're looking for the mysterious shrine. I need time to and trying to avoid getting exploded. You there? Yes, you. I would have one. All right, let's uh, talk with the shrine. Who's speaking? You stand. First, we need a suitable vessel for my transfer. There is a cave nearby, housing a magically sealed chest. Open it with the chant, Isun Seni Aproxus. Bring me the contents of this chest, and you will be rewarded. <laughs> will be rewarded. Never sounds like it's um, it's a positive thing. Like, I will put you out of your misery. We're back up to 19 cinders, so we might be able to get another small... small reward. cinders we are full let's head back to town quickly and sell our spare stuff I wonder if I yeah sorting it doesn't sort by rarity unfortunately <clears throat> that's okay oh, I've got more than baubles yes yes I'll take it Tell each of those and back out we go. Uh, we'll oh, it's intelligence either way. Let's uh, go this way. <clears throat> now each of these paragon points we're putting in um, by increasing our base stats, they are making us better and stronger. So it is. Uh, it is going to affect um, 
our performance and uh, like the level of dungeons and stuff that we can uh, we can go for. Wants us to go into that dungeon, but I'm not actually that keen on doing that right this second. Mostly using it as an opportunity to um, explore the area. quiet enough for the moment. Let's head up here and search for Darwood in our last couple of minutes. I need time. There's another one of those Helltide Harbingers. And another drop for us to have a look at. Cool. Now, all these drops um, I'll be assessing at the end. We're not going to um, spend time digging through them all as we... Uh, progress otherwise we're just going to waste a lot of time let's get on our horse this looks like it's going to be quite far One cinder for all of that fire doesn't feel like a good return on investment. That's better. Up to 67. We might make it to another... Another reward of some kind. Ooh, what's this? Caravan under siege. I suppose we can uh, we can do an event. We are pretty close to the actual side quest that we're trying to do, though. They grab all these bits and now we are on the lookout for another tortured gift of some kind. Do we have one close by? Potentially there. Oh actually there's one that's uh, jewellery, so it's likely to cost a bit more. Kind of funny being able to shoot them from up here and then have the firewall appear down there. I think we'll we'll climb down. Hmm. 
No sign of Darwood over here. There you are. They hide it in out, but I've tracked it. Okay, so Darwood wants us to uh, help with the spotted murder. Thinks it's just over here. I'm not ready yet. Let's do it. Out of mana once again. Plenty, plenty of cinders. See how much health this chap got back. The crows, you bastards. Let's hope their friends find them rotting in the sun. It's time they feel the iron wolves again. It feels a bit like the iron wolves is just like some um, street gang. Okay, if we find another 15 cinders. I reckon we can go and do that gift of jewelry. Let's let's head over to it. We'll see if we can uh, pick them up nearby. How much is it going to take? Oh, it's only going to take uh, seventy-five. All right. In that case, we'll, we'll just clear these mobs out, make the area safe, and open it up. My bags are full. Nothing spectacular. Iron skin elixir, elixir of magic resistance. I don't think I care about dropping any. Maybe the one week assault elixir. In exchange for that. That'll probably do for now. Okay, with uh, 45 cinders, I don't think we're going to get anything else worthwhile. So let's head back to town and we'll take stock of where we are. So we need to go and speak with Harad. Let's go do that. And we need to bring the spotted mushroom to Veroka, but I think that's that's quite far away. Still, we can always town portal. He did. Damned it will. Quest complete. It's a cache of ore for us. That's very nice. Yeah, spotted mushrooms over in Kyovishad. All right, in we go. When something spans regions like this, I wonder where the uh, renown ends up going to. A good eye. Kedjistan. It was specifically Kedjistan Renown. Right, so let's have a look at our Renown. Dry steps, we didn't really do much there. How is our... We are, let's say, 390 away 
and Kedjistan, we are a lot closer. So if we focus on Kedjistan's side quests next time, uh, we'll be able to get four more Paragon points and uh, really push that forwards. What do we get in terms of decent items? We're going to salvage that up. We're going to salvage that up. We're going to salvage that up. That's a really low roll. Salvage that. Salvage that. And salvage that. This is an interesting one. The Starlight Circle. For every 25% of your life you heal, you gain primary resource. Conceptually, I really like it because we're healing all the time with our burning stuff that we're putting on things. But we would need to sacrifice something in order to to utilize that and from my build i don't know if there's anything we can sacrifice still we'll sell anything that's not legendary we'll salvage up the legendary stuff and uh, drop all that off in terms of the season journey let's uh let's sneak ahead to the destroyer level Two out of three Tortured Gifts of Mysteries. This is what we've been uh, pushing for at the moment. On our champion level, uh, we're just looking to gain experience, really. We can uh, certainly go on to the Nightmare Echo of Varshan, but I think I'd want to be a bit higher level before we do that. Uh, and once we get back in the dungeons, we'll be improving the glyphs. To rank 20 is, is a pretty, pretty big feat, but uh, if we're... If we're going for higher tier dungeons, then that's that's going to come over time. In terms of the actual progression down here, the next thing that we're going to get is at rank 78, which isn't that far away, given how quickly we're pushing through these. So, yeah, I, I think we're in a pretty good state. Thank you very much for coming along, everyone. I do hope you have enjoyed this. As always, if you have, be sure to give a big thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, go ahead and do so, and you'll be told when the next episode goes live. Otherwise, I'll see you next time for another episode of Diablo well 4. Struck. See you soon.